all in all that wasn't too bad uh, that sander uh, for what it is for well avalanche 59 bucks the little sucker works pretty good I got uh, switched it over to like a 60 grit belt or an 80 I'm not sure all right I'm gonna uh, put a little water on this and I got extra soft paper towel for those of you who are sensitive to the sound this is about as close as I want to get it on the roughed out I mean it's still really rough but this wood is so soft that hand sanding shouldn't be too difficult to just smooth out the edges the belt marks shine up the rivets all that all in all it came out pretty decent it's a little out of the ordinary shape because of the finger choil and stuff but it fits my hand here I might have to make this a little deeper for my pinky but it fits my hand good here good purchase on it and then when I choke up it's awesome but the wood looks pretty damn nice too so I think that's gonna shine up real nice I might do something a little more with the butt rounded over or whatever but I kinda like the idea of right so all in all uh, whoa I'm not gonna show you the hand sanding part I mean how boring I'll turn this back on in a few minutes when I get it like 80 or 90 percent complete it should bring out that grain a little nicer so I'm gonna grab my flexible sandpaper and do some little hand sanding on it get the rest of the glue off uh, I got a little bit on the spine I didn't want to touch that with a belt or I would have hit metal probably because I only have about an eighth inch here so I'll just ease that down let me get back with you in a minute when I uh, get it a little nicer I'll show you a little bit of the hand sanding I'll uh, tack it on the end. This flexible paper is so awesome. What an invention. I mean, it's just crazy how good it works. You're rolling the dust off it. Awesome. It's going to work really good. This is 100 grit and it's already smooth enough for my taste. But uh, I'm going to go down up to 220 just to get it really nice and slick. So there you go. There's a little bit of the sanding. This stuff uh, it seems to wear forever. I'm still uh, from the original uh, ferro rod handles I was making with that flexible paper. The paper is still cutting good. And that's 220. I've done a lot of sanding with it. It's good stuff. All right, I got to put my dust mask back on. Let me shut this off, and uh, I'm letting a, the longest part of the video upload right now. So I'll sand for a while and then go check the computer. See you in a few. All right, I think I'm done for the night. I got her down pretty decent with 100 down to 100 grit. I think I'm done for the night. I'm pooped, but it's starting to shine up pretty decent. getting there. Let me see if I can get a little bit more light on it. I got one little flaw I need to take care of. Well, that don't help, does it? All in all, it's looking pretty decent. I got the butt kind of rounded over, nice and comfortable. Got my little profile on the bottom. The grip feels good. This side really pops. So I think she's going to look pretty dang decent. All right. Thanks, everybody. Get some sleep. Ciao. I'll try to get this up tonight, if not tomorrow. Let me get her rendered. Play nice. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this new crazy mother. Yeah.